Why was it so important to have uh, the small group actually focused you know, on uh, art and preserving art? Why was that such an important goal that during the midst of all of this death and chaos, this was something that this group pursued? I'm so glad you've asked that question because this is one of the questions that's at the basis of my novel, Balto's Nose. Why is art important, especially when it comes to people's lives and situations? Well, clearly, why people fight wars is as important as why we have the peace after these wars. The Monuments Men, and in particular General Eisenhower, were extremely aware we were not just fighting one of the worst evils that humanity has somehow created. We were also fighting for our own civilization. So these monuments of the past were very literally our civilization. There was no use winning a war on a battlefield unless you were going to somehow lose the battle for that civilization after the war. And so what we do with our art during warfare really determines what happens to us after the bullets have stopped flying. And so these people were very, very aware of the monuments of civilization help us to be civilized.